guys, what is up? Welcome back to Vlogmas day three. It is Sunday, December 3rd, and we're having a little bit of a later start to the day. I slept in till about like 10 45 this morning the last few nights i've been editing vlogmas until like almost midnight and so i just stay up and wait for it to be posted um so i have just not been getting a ton of sleep lately so i slept in a little bit this morning made some breakfast some eggs some bacon some orange juice and we kind of just hung out for a little bit and just had like a slow relaxing sunday morning but we are going grocery shopping right now we need to go to the grocery store and also i want to stop at whole foods to get a couple things but it is like the most gloomy day out today and it's pouring rain but it's also kind of snowing and the snowflakes are like massive but just having a like cozy little sunday we don't really have anything planned for today maybe we'll watch a christmas movie later maybe do some baking so and the zip up is from Brandy. It's so cozy. It's reversible, but I love like the Sherpa. It's just so warm, but we are going to go to the grocery store now and I'll do like a big grocery haul. We honestly need a lot of stuff. So it's going to be like a big restock and then I'll organize my fridge, my pantry, all of that stuff. I love to do kind of like organizing and just like a refresh on Sundays. So this will be like a little Sunday reset vlog. Vlogmas edition. grocery shopping i want to give you guys a quick little haul of everything that we got we got a couple of like new things to try which i'm very excited starting over here we got a ton of like little potatoes and some carrots we're going to make a pot roast tonight i figured it was like the perfect meal for the 12 days of new recipes that i'm doing and it's so like cold rainy and like snowy out so it's like the perfect comforting meal and we're gonna start cooking that in about an hour it's around 4 p.m right now and it takes about three hours to make so we got that and i'll show you the pot roast in a minute and then we got some bananas i got these ones at whole foods because they were more ripe and i wanted to be able to have a smoothie tomorrow morning so we got those and then we got a pomegranate i haven't had a pomegranate in so long and so i wanted to have that for like fruit bowls things like that over yogurt so i thought that'd be really yummy and i've been wanting to try to just eat more seasonally and i know that these are in season right now so got that and then got some raspberries also for like some fruit bowls and then i got some almond butter i liked this brand because it only contains organic dry roasted almonds and i don't think i've mentioned this to you guys yet but i am like having such a hard time growing my hair i feel like my hair is not like falling out but it's like really just dry and i haven't been dying or doing anything and so i'm kind of thinking i need to like eat more just like nutritious foods like i need to start eating fish and like spinach more greens and one of the things it recommended was almond butter and i've been using peanut butter in my smoothies so i'm hoping that this like little switch i'm starting small will just help a little bit so i'm gonna try that and i found this one at whole foods and then i'm so excited to try this i have been a fan of nut pods since i was like 16 and so i wanted to try their cinnamon swirl coffee creamer so very excited to try that next we got these wings these chicken wings sorry if you can hear the cats in the background they're like literally going nuts but this is the brand denny mike's we get these at whole foods and they're already marinated and they're honestly just really yummy we stick them in the air fryer and they come out so bomb they're so good um and then got some fresh local eggnog which i am very excited to try this I am a huge fan of eggnog. I know it's very controversial and a lot of people don't like it, but 
I love it and I wanted to get this little bottle so got that and then I'm going to make another simmer pot I already have cranberry so I got some cinnamon sticks and another orange and then I'm going to start juicing again this next week I'm only going to do it for like three days so I just got three things of celery two lemons and I have a ton of green apples already so all set with that got some cheese some broccoli for the wing night and then we got some rolls and we got some unhealthy stuff but honestly what are you gonna do so we got three different types of chips these are so good if you haven't had these before you need to try them they're the all dressed potato chips they are so good and then these are my favorite the cheddar and sour cream so bomb and then we just got some tortilla chips because we're gonna make chili like I think like two times this week got all of these and then drake picked this out it's honey bunches of oats which i love them and then these are frosted honey bunches of oats so i feel like they're like frosted flakes with honey bunches of oats so i'm honestly very excited to have that like a quick easy breakfast and then over here we got some milk iced coffee this is like a vanilla medium roast. We haven't tried this before, but Drake usually gets like the blonde roast. And so this was like the only one they had. So excited to try that. Some crackers for chili. Got some chicken broth for a lasagna soup that we're going to make later this week. And then we got an onion for that. We were out of black pepper. Got some organic raw honey. And then for sandwiches, we just got some provolone, some turkey some more butter more frozen fruit for my smoothies in the mornings got some flour tortillas and then this is all of the chili stuff we get ground turkey i just like it better um and then this is all the stuff that we get we get the chili magic you guys honestly need to try this if you can find this i'm telling you it will make your chili a thousand times better it's so good it's drake's mom's recipe and it's just so good we got some rotel we put that in there as well and then stewed tomato and then this is for the lasagna soup we just got some san marzano crushed tomatoes some tomato paste for that and we are a huge haagen fan in this house coffee is the best ice cream flavor there is no argument to be had it is just superior it is so good and then we got some vanilla and then drake loves the dulce de leche so we love haagen it is literally the best i've tried other ice creams and it just doesn't compare so the best and then this is the pot roast that we got it is just a boneless chuck pot roast so if you're looking to make one this is the one that we usually get from just like our local grocery store and it was on sale this time they're usually like 25 dollars, and it was 17 so and then we just cook it in beef broth so i get two things of these but i will show you guys a more in-depth recipe in like about an hour um when we start cooking it for dinner i also forgot to show you guys we got some flowers i just like to get roses because i have cats and it honestly just kind of scares me to get like any other flower i just know that these ones are like the most safe to have when you have cats around um they never try to like eat flowers or anything like that or like they're honestly very good frankie is like slowly learning but ollie is such an angel he'll never like chew on anything he knows he's not supposed to but i keep them on the counter and they never jump on the counter but i just feel better buying roses so i'm always <laughs> buying roses but i feel like these ones look so beautiful they're like a light pink and they have some green so i just feel like they're really beautiful i'm going to put all the groceries away and then i need to put these in some water and probably by the time i'm done we will start making dinner this wicker basket is from home goods and it's honestly perfect and it just fits all of our like fruits and things like that and we put it right above our fridge and it's honestly it looks really cute i'm gonna do a little taste test of this eggnog because i'm really excited i feel like it's gonna be really good
about to start making dinner. We are making a pot roast, like I said earlier, and this is day two of the 12 days of new recipes. I'm very excited. This one is so just comforting and warm, perfect for a winter day. So first things first, you're going to need some sort of like big pot. I love my Lodge Dutch oven. It's very similar to the Le Creuset one, but it's perfect for soups, pot roast, pasta dishes, really anything, and it's like amazing quality. And the Lodge one is honestly like half the price of the Le Creuset one, and it works just as well. I'm going to take some olive oil. This is the Frankie's olive oil, and I'm just going to kind of coat the pan just because just because it's a big roast. And I'm going to put this on medium heat. And the next step is to season the roast. So I'm just going to do a very simple salt and pepper rub on this and you want to make sure that you like apply it liberally because you want to make sure that you have enough seasoning since it is such a big like chunk of meat so i'm just going to rub some salt and pepper on it and then this is going to get very hot and so you want to sear the roast and you want to sear the roast on both sides and like all the edges so it gets like a little crispy and then that's when you start adding like everything else Okay, just peeled the potatoes and carrots, and now I'm just going to chop those up while everything else is getting ready. This is the beef broth that we use and this is searing right now it's actually done so we're going to add all the veggies in first and then cover everything with the beef broth so good i honestly forgot to get a clip of it we were just so hungry and it's about like 9 30 right now i need to get this video up for you guys but i just wanted to end off the vlogmas day three i hope you guys enjoyed watching i know this video was a little bit shorter um but we honestly just didn't really do much today but tomorrow is monday december 4th so make sure you are subscribed so you don't miss out on vlogmas day four tomorrow it is gonna be just like a basic work day i need to catch up on a lot of work tomorrow so maybe i can show you guys like a work day in my life make breakfast all that stuff so i love you guys and i'll see you